माय फ्रेंड्स इन माय 200 थ्री कैट मॉडल्स इन फ्री कैट सीरीज एक्सरसाइज 127 इज इट्स अ रियल इजी वन दिस इज सो इजी आई वोंट बी यूजिंग द टेक्निकल ड्राइंग लेट्स गो अहेड एंड डू इट विदाउट द ड्राइंग एंड आई विल डू वन बेटर टू दिस प्रैक्टिस I will make this a parametric modeling. That way, we can change this diameter and everything else through a spreadsheet. So first thing first, I will have to draw a cylinder. Okay, and so I can use the primitive from part workbench, and then the inside diameter is eighty. So let's go ahead and fix the outer one, which is fifty radius, and the inner one is. 40 and then height will go halfway through so let's go ahead and make it 40 All right so that's our first tube and then on top of that we'll have to build these three flanges and i want to use sketch on xy plane and then so at this point i think if we are making a parametric via spreadsheet let's go ahead and actually build that spreadsheet right now so we don't have to come back to it i'm going to rename that as ss i saw that one of the youtube channels said he uh the author he renamed it as an ss so it's not my idea okay so i'm going to say inner diameter actually will go with radius and outer radius or we can go with thickness actually thickness and this we can go with outer dia all right and then i'm going to say height height of the total object so it would be total height and then how about those uh, flanges the bolt holders i don't know what it is called i'm gonna call them ears looks like a bunny ear to me okay so number of ears now we have three and then total height we have 80 and thickness we have 10 millimeter and outer radius we have 50 millimeter Okay, we'll have to apply some aliases on this. So this is going to be outer radius. And this is going to be, oopsie. Thickness. And this one is total height. And this is number of years. Now that we have that spreadsheet taken care of, let's go ahead and Highlight side by side. Okay, now we have both of the side by side, and this one in the tube side. So height will go. This is dot. It was total height divided by two. We were going half halfway. And then later we'll mirror it over. In a radius, we'll go outer radius first. So this is going to be SS dot outer radius. And in a radius is SS dot outer radius minus thickness yep there it is so we get our now we, we change anything we make it five that kind of thins out the thickness let's go back to 10 and keep it there now we are talking about these ears we'll make three of them and i want to do that through that is two workbench and oh we can do that on rough workbench as well doesn't matter 
Okay, let's go ahead and draw a sketch on XY plane and there will be an offset of 40 millimeter. We'll have to come back to formulate this 40 millimeter. And here I want to draw this bunny ear. Actually, it is a half slot. So I'm going to go ahead and draw a slot and delete this edge and bring it all the way up here. Okay. I can take this as a reference. Let's go ahead and take that as a reference. And then I want to make this to horizontal. And place this one on this curve. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and create an arc right now between these two points. And make these two equal. Cool. Now I can say this is radius 20. So we keep that fixed. And the inside there will be another circle which is radius 10. Finally, this length it is on a 140 millimeter diameter circle so the distance will be now 140 let's take a moment and see how this 140 comes so the inside radius is 40 outside radius is 50 right and this is coming as 140 so if i make that as a formula so i'm going to say this distance is going to be SS dot outer radius, which is 50 times 2, that's 100, plus the inner radius, right? Plus, so inner radius is SS dot outer radius minus the thickness. All right, so that is there 140 comes around now every time we change anything it will it will be changed accordingly Okay, actually it will be divided by two Pretty cool, so we got that formula entered in there now every time we change anything so we make it 55 Actually it did not change because we got this reference so we cannot use the reference we will have to come up with something else let's take that reference out and make this so now we have one degrees of freedom which is the radius of this outer arc and that will be actually the outer radius so it's better that way cool now we change anything it will be it's not changing hmm, that's weird i did change okay so say 60 right now it's changing Cool, maybe it was changing previously as well. We just didn't refresh it. All right, so now we have that sketch built up. So I'm going to rename that as Okay, and I want to extrude that for a thickness of 15. And this 15 will go reversed. That's a little thicker than what I zoom. Okay. Maybe it's right. All right. We have the, we have one of the ears. Let's say here. And now I can go to 
draft workbench and take the year apply a polar array of three and say reset point to make it center of rotation at zero cool now on this number of three we have to draw that from the spreadsheet so here we can say in the polar array number of polar array we can say we, we link it with the number of years on the spreadsheet pretty cool now we can make it four that will create four of them or even five that will create five of them so there is that okay the one thing left is to put this together so go back to part workbench and then make it a fusion and then something happened i think these two are not matching Ooh. that's not what i wanted so let's see this array i want to make it a compound right now can we make it a union yes we can so making that compound was was important i guess okay so we get half of the object half let's say upper half now to get the lower half i want to mirror it against the x y plane and there it is that's our lower half and let's go ahead and make that a fusion and that i say is our final object now let's see if our things worked out so we want to say four years we can have it we want to make it a thinner wall we can have it we can make it a bigger one or like even smaller one we can have it pretty cool we can even make it taller ah, there it is the one thing we left out was we did not find that catch so the array there is the year and here we said we'll come back to actually make this 40 as a formula we did not do that so let's go ahead and do that and this will be total height divided by 2 there so now we can make it even taller everything will move towards now we can even make it a configuration say we want to have three configurations named a say i'm gonna say i will go with the coffee size small medium large right and on the smaller one the outer radius i'm going to say would be 30 so we have three configurations set up here and i want to make that a configuration table on the right click and say configuration table and the range i want to say up to e7 awesome. and on the property i'm going to say size and in the group i want to say configuration or say model right now it's pulling data from the small one and we can actually find it in there under the spreadsheet here it says model size small we can go medium okay i can see a problem with this small configuration it's so short that it's becoming only one we don't want to do that so let's go ahead and update the height as 35 maybe 40. okay and then the medium one let's make it 60 so it looks good and then we have 
So now let's see if all three configurations work. So small working, medium working, and then large working. I think I misspelled medium. Okay. I want to place this configuration within the final object. So I want to make a part and take the final object into the part there and then update that configuration table. Here I must say part dot size. Okay. All right, now it is in here. We don't even need the spreadsheet anymore. We can we can take a look at it, but we don't need that. So within the part, in the model, we can say size is small, medium, and large. Pretty cool. That's the end of this video. I hope you like this. If you have any question or any comment, please let me know in the comment section. Uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.